What's up everybody, it's your boy RPG Authority, back with another video, you read the title. What build is this? The Wild Hunt build alternates between your bow and your polearm to dominate your enemies. The physical damage is high, giving you an advantage over a majority of the enemies in the game. This build is simple to play, but a few items and skills you need may take a tiny bit longer to acquire. Luckily, you can substitute them for an easier to obtain version in the meanwhile. And to top it off, this build requires almost zero mana, making it a great choice for those who do not want to focus on the mana side of things. Before combat, make sure you have your food and boons active. Then use sniper shot and piercing shot. Finishing up your bow rotation with a strafing run. Now at this point you can continue to kite with the bow or you can swap over to your halberd and open up with perfect strike followed by moon swipe and then execute with splitter. And remember the lower the HP of your enemy the more damage splitter does. So depending on your combat style and the opponent you're facing you can seamlessly switch between bow and halberd giving you short and long range choices. The Tsar Halberd does take a little bit of time to get so you can substitute it with any of the following. The Vampiric Halberd, the Vigilante Halberd, the Marble Halberd or Duty. For skills you can also change Piercing Shot for Predator Leap or Counter Strike. Global Offensive. If you want to use some boons like cool or warm for extra resistances against certain enemies you can because if you have the mana for the infused wind buff you will have enough to cast those boons. Keep in mind that your Ciezo Savage restores mana and you can also keep a few mana pots handy if you want to stack the boons all at once. 